Wow, someone took the. I don't know if it's ever worth it. Someone took the. Ooh. Oh, let's see. These ain't gonna work it anyway. No. Fail. Fail. Okay, like. This is what I should have. I should have took this with me when I went to Home Depot. But now look, like. So yeah, I saw me trying to replace my lighting thing. And look, this is what I need. And this is what I bought. Like, look at this. This is why I should have brought it. Something told me to bring it. And I just, I was, wasn't was thinking. So I'm going to take that back to Home Depot anyway. And then when I open up the package, it says three pack, right? It says three pack. So tell me why I don't only have two. Tell me why I only have two of these. Like, I'll open the package and I'm like, there was only two. I'm like, okay, so somebody took one out of the package and everything. Like, oh, just. Mm, mm, mm. I can't believe that mess. So I'm going to take this back and be like, it's not even the right size. So stupid. And then on top of that, they didn't even do it right. Okay, it came with two of these light bulbs in here. And basically, if I take it back and they ask me, I'm going to tell them. Home Depot. <sighs> cannot find what I'm looking for because I see some I see some light bulbs look like this but the their wattage is too high like they're only oh no I, f I think I found it hold on I think this is the one I need because this one is 60 watts you know versus I don't this might work okay let's see if these work oh they do because bro i'm tired of going to the return and stuff it was, it was it's just like um, let's see okay i need to dust my light Um, it is me, your Kia Harris. Welcome to all the newbies. Um, and hello, what's up to all the reoccurring, the subbies. So thank you so much for supporting me. But um, yeah, today um, I'm just going to focus on really cleaning my room. Um, and because I got like pillows and stuff like that. I just need to kind of like, you know, clean my bed spread, put it away. It is giving fall. It's not longer fall. So I need to kind of get into more like my birthday is in March. So I feel like I'm a very like... I like the idea of like renewing, refresh, like feeling. Um, usually, like if you in like English class and stuff like that, they talk about like the four seasons. Like, you know, spring is always about like new birth, new beginnings. Summer is just kind of like the prime season. Um, fall is about kind of like um, I forgot what fall was about, but like fall is kind of like you know, I guess kind of like your you're getting older, you're more wiser, you're starting to kind of like be selective, you know, you shedding some of those people that need to, you know, that the leaves, some of them leaves be falling and, you know, they're the, you know, some of them, you know what I mean, some of them leaves be falling and, you know, those are the leaves that, you know, need to fall, you know, and then winter kind of represents like, you know, well, it usually represents like death um, or it represents just kind of like an ending type of thing. So I feel like spring is my favorite time and it's not spring yet, but spring's coming 
um in about a month or so so i feel like i'm kind of in that mood to kind of refresh it's beautiful outside it's really nice and warm here in the denver area um warm as in sense of like 50 degrees and 50 degrees in denver is pretty warm if there's no like winds so yeah so um me and my mom are gonna try to go to um do a little shopping shopping um and work on that i don't want to give too many things away because i'm getting a friend i'm getting a gift for janet janet's one of my best friends um and she is going um i mean she oh my god i cannot talk her birthday it might train a thought her birth her birthday is on february 13th and so i want to give her like a you know give her a little birthday gift and stuff so i don't want to say like you know this this video is going to come out before she like Mm hmm. I don't. I don't know if I'm. Well, I might meet her next week. It depends. You know, the plans ain't that set of stone. Like I don't plan that in advance, but I might meet up with her. But um, yeah. So I don't want to say like, oh, I want to get her this, but I do want to get her something for her birthday. So that's what I'm gonna do. And um, yeah. Also, I wanted to mention that I got some new shelving. I bought some last week, so I'm gonna be working on building it. You know, changing things up, changing things up. Okay, you know, like. This is what the the titles, the titles of these vlogs, you guys, on my thumbnails are intentional. Like, they literally are things of the theme of the week. And this theme is changing things up. So, I'm changing my bed spread. You know, I got some new, new plants a little bit. I'm really excited about that. You know, I love, bro, spring, I'm telling you spring's my season because the plants be coming out and I just, uh, I love it for me. Um, but yeah, so anyway, let's get back to the subject. The subject was that I got some new shelving. The, um, ones that I had before, um, are from Ikea. And I'll show you guys, I'll s show a picture of it, but they're from Ikea. And I've had them for about, since COVID. Like, I bought them probably around COVID time. And they work really well. They're just not the style that I want. You know, I like antique vibes. I'm kind of more into, like, the Victorian era vibes. So I love things with a lot of swirls and, like, character like as you can see like my ch my drawer my chester drawer you know has a lot of character and stuff like that and you know i love it so much like i like those types of things um i even like even my desk like is antique like, i like me some antiques so i finally was able to find a shelving that was like it's wrought iron and um i'll have a picture of it right here as well you know i'm gonna have to be doing some picturing some picturing <laughs> that's not even a word but i have to have some images right there but my point is, is that, um, I finally found some, it's taking, bro, trying to find, like, certain furniture is really, really hard. Like, just imagine furnishing a whole home. Mm -hmm. So, it's hard. <laughs> but, um, yeah, so I got that, and so, um, I'm gonna try to build that this week. I'm excited to do that, and I just gotta rearrange my room a little bit, because they're, um, they're gonna be longer. Like, the width of those, are they're a lot longer, and I got two of them, so they're going to be a little longer, so I got to move my end tables kind of back facing me, and then I got to clean up, too, and I got to empty all, I got to take all the stuff on the shelf, like, it's a process, so um, I'm going to take you guys, you know, obviously along with that for this week, um, I need to empty my suitcase, because it's still there so i'm doing that now like i'm about to empty my suitcase now all my clothes are clean so because i washed them and I, we had a wash and dryer so i just got to put them away and you know just kind of you know get back in you know kind of get get back to doing things but um, i'm really excited to kind of change my room up it's time so um yeah that is what is happening um that's what's happening this week but today like i said shopping emptying my suitcase and who knows We'll see where this day goes, and uh, I'm so glad you guys are um, coming along with me um, and enjoying this journey with me. So, um, yeah. Last thing, bro, and Lou, this is last thing. Um, I um, I met up with Maya um, G um yesterday. That was like the ramen footage. We went to this new ramen place, and it was pretty good. Like it wasn't. I ate a lot before. Like I had that chipotle before, so I didn't. I wasn't like starving, but it was pretty good. I gotta ask Maya. Like we we were busy talking about everything else besides the food, <laughs> because I haven't seen her in such a long time. Like I haven't seen Maya in like at least six weeks. You know, and like with the holiday, it's just it was. It's been a lot. So a lot has been happening with her. You know, because she's been traveling. I've been traveling. Like you know being a newlywed like you know it's just a lot of transition you know getting you know the house how's the house going so we, we just were talking 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 and i didn't even get to ask her how the food was so i got a text her to ask her but i would give it like an eight out of ten like it's pretty good i think um the so i think there are I, oh, bro, oh my god why can't i say what i need to say 
I feel like I've tried a little bit better ramen um, in different places before um, that I've hung, that I've you know did, have done with my friends, but it wasn't too bad. But I just wanted to mention that. So yeah, I didn't hang around with uh, Maya G, and she let me um, borrow some of her um, gear. Okay, cause um you know I'm doing some adventuring. Okay, I'm doing some adventuring. So the vlog that vlog will come up like. Mm, that'll probably be like the um la that will, that vlog will probably be posted like the end of February, but it, I'm so excited for that. But anyway, I needed to have some selective gear, so I got some, you know, I needed some like specialty like ski pants type of thing, and I'm not going skiing, but I'm gonna be doing something. I don't want to say it. it's a surprise, but <laughs> um, I need some like ski pants, and I was like, girl, you got some goggles, and she got the goggles, okay, like, she got them for me, so, shout out to you, Maya G, like, you are, if I ever become YouTube famous, like, I got you, period, so, <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, so I got to hang out with her, I got to give her her souvenir, and chit chat, as usual, it's always a great time with my friends, with my best friends, it, it never fails, like, I always wish I had more time to talk with them, but you know, people got things to do, jobs to do, life to do. So, um, but I'll hang out with her soon. But um, yeah, so now let's get <laughs> let's get the rest of this of today's um filming and, yeah task and stuff. Let, let's get into it. <laughs> So here are my clothes mostly. But then I realized, like, bruh, I, s <laughs> I have Monica's bag and I have her ears, um, the ears in here. And I was like, dang. And I dropped off her souvenir stuff to her yesterday. So I'm like, dang it. I forgot to give her her bag. So um, I, and, you know, I hang out with Monica anyway, but I just realized that. I'm like, dang, I forgot to give her this. So um, I got to remember to drop that, give her that. Um, cause I almost forgot. You know, I've been so busy, so, um, yeah. So I did get a little thing from Ulta Beauty, so I'm really excited about that. So I'll show you guys real quick. Nothing crazy. I just got these pattern microfiber towels. I really love these. I recently bought one um, that you guys saw in, like, was it the last weekly vlog? I think it was the last weekly vlog. But anyway, I got two more um, online. I just went online because I was like, yeah, I know they're not going to have them in store. And I really, really like them. Like, I think they're worth the hype. So I got two of them. And I just need to get one more and then I'll be good. Because like I said, I just want to have it at least like four total. So that's all I got from Ulta. And yeah. <laughs> here is the finished cleanup <laughs> and i'm gonna need to vacuum i have like dead leaves and just dust and all that type of stuff on the bottom of here. So I'm going to get the vacuum and do that. And then I'm going to um, <clears throat> carry these out. And um, yeah, clean them off. You know, like they're dusty and they have dirt and stuff. And then um, I'll probably, I think I should clean them, off, clean them and then take them out. But yeah, this is how they look like. This is These are the Ikea. I forgot the name of them. Um, I'll put it up on top, but these are the, um, those type of Ikea ones. And I do like them. They're made very, very well. You saw how much stuff I had, so it's very sturdy. It's just not the style I'm looking for, but, yep. All cleared out. Bottom to top.
this shelf right here and um, as you can kind of see what the look is going I don't mind having the two frames be the same right there it doesn't bother me so much um, but I did get the frames at Holly Lobby and I got this beautiful um, bow mirror what's up <laughs> um, Holly Lobby as well so yeah and then this is like an antique that I got um, at the um, Goodwill but anyway that's besides the point um, but yes, this is kind of what's looking like. I really like it. And I have a frame that I think I'm, a, I mean, a picture, um, art. Yeah, I have art. I don't know why I didn't say that. I have art that I want to put up. But quickly, I wanted to show you guys, like, Janet gave me this, like, from one of her trips last year. But, um, she gave me this. This is the most recent souvenir she gave me, which is this beautiful, um, vase. And so I'm going to, I put it right here. And, um, I just gotta get the flowers to there you go and so it's right there but yeah and then i got my pinky beans but yeah so this is kind of what's looking like um i just put i know that's a dead plan but that's just a placeholder but so far like i i think it looks good so um the painting i'm going to use i know i got stuff everywhere i'm i'm transitioning <laughs> is this painting right here i got at holly lobby for um let's see i got it for ten dollars and I think I want this, I wanted to put this one over my bed, but I decided that I think I'm going to put this one in that section. And then I'm going to put these two, which these two were above that plant stand, but I took them down and I think I'm going to put these over my bed. So that's kind of what I'm planning on doing. And um, yeah. So I got these 16 pound command strips. I'm going to put two on each side. So that should be good enough to hold up this um frame so um yep let's get into it <music> Now, these paintings over here are these drawings I got from Holly Lobby as well. Um, and they're really simple. So, I think these will go better over my bed because, like, I'm always changing my bed um, at least once a season. And my bed spreads pretty colorful or patterned because um, that's what it's, that's just what I like. So, I, have to, I don't have to worry about, like, adding color or anything. So, I'm going to just use this. Um, they already have the same, um, what's it called? It? The same command strip. So, I just have to, like going and even um my bedroom the hard part is is making sure like they're even not so much also in like this on two because i'm putting two but make sure like it's even not so much like the frames are like equal like on the top and the bottom but also the width like the width is really important to make sure it's even so that's the hard part about this but um yeah but you do what you gotta do and we're gonna get into it so um yeah this happened so I'm gonna try to repair it with some tape I got some um, just some like clear tape that I'm gonna try to repair it with and hope for the best because yeah it ripped pretty good as I taped here and then I taped underneath as you can you know, I can see on the side um, and then I put a new command um, strip on here because there's no I was like bro I'm not even gonna try and I have extra so I have extra, so um, let's try this again. 
some extra just reinforcement on the side right here um just in case um so yeah it should be it's pretty secure so i did that on both sides um just a heads up but this is i'm so happy how this turned out it was a little bit of a struggle with the taping and all that type of stuff but it looks really good and um yeah i really like it um and now i can take a break <laughs> i think i'm gonna put my um um what's it call it my bedspread and stuff on because it's just i just put like my sheets but i think i'll put my bedspread and stuff on um in the next couple days so you'll see that in the next vlog but i really like how this turned out it looks so good so um it's slowly coming together i'm pooped i am pooped oh my god like i am exhausted i'm just like i'm done for today i'm done for a couple days um to be honest like this bedspread is not gonna get on here till a couple days for now like i mentioned but anyway i quickly um want to tell you guys a little story time okay a little story time so what had happened was <laughs> that's how all this start like literally I'm trying to get some good lighting so what had happened was um so you guys know my um travel vlogs that i've been posting i posted one for um, west palm beach and the other one i posted was for disney well, I guess they got like a, a out, like, you know how the videos pop up and it like was able to outreach to this one, um, this one woman, her name, her handle is Angela Coco and you guys, she is from the UK. Okay. And, um, she's also, um, black as well. And it was just so awesome to just, homegirl was on, she actually like, talked to me on instagram and i was like what like me who, who 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 you know i'm like what the heck but i was so it was just so amazing how the internet can just like really the internet definitely makes the world a lot smaller but it's really cool how you can interact with people from like all types of the world so i'm like oh my god like i'm able am i able to have a uk best friend am i able to have international friends me you know but anyway um she actually does travel content as well and she was like, oh my god, like, your travel content looks good. I'm like, girl, your content looks really good, too. So, anyway, you guys know I love to support all types of people. People that are trying to do positive things and are trying to open our perspectives and give us a glimpse of how amazing the world can be. Even though sometimes it might not feel like it, but I know there's definitely some good people out there. And Angela Coco is one of them, okay? So, um, I'm going to put her information um, right over here. Um, I'll put um, a picture of her um, Instagram and as well as her channel. And I'll also link that's her information in the comment section below. Or I should say the description box. But I'm so new to this. So, <laughs> I'll link in the description box below. But definitely check her out. Like, I watched, like, a couple of her videos. And they're really, really cool. And it's so, it's just interesting how different parts of the world it's just you guys i just want to go like i just want to go so if i'm in the uk i'm gonna hit up i'm gonna hit her up period but yeah i just had to tell you guys that because i just thought it was so cool like this girl from the uk like saw my video like from colorado from denver like what so yeah i'm really happy about that but anyway yeah definitely make sure to um check her out and like i said i'll let i'll leave all her information in the description box below but on that note, I am going to end this vlog here and, um, you know, I got a lot of stuff to, <laughs> bro, do I have to show you my bed? Like, <laughs> it ain't, <laughs> I have a lot of stuff to do, but I am just too tired today and I just want to take a couple days just to relax and then I'll get back on it eventually, so, and I gotta clean my bedspread and everything, so, anyway, hmm, <sighs> yeah. I'm going to end this vlog here, and I want to thank you guys so much for supporting me. I really appreciate it, and you know my outro. As the girlies on YouTube be saying, make sure you share, comment, like, and subscribe, and I will catch you guys in the next video. Bye!